I used to have the perfect life. My name is Kelvin Summers. Like I said, my life was perfect. We met in math class. It was the first day of school. We didn't even know each other. You're Calvin, right? Calvin Summers? I'm Olivia, but you can call me Liv. Well, after that, math became something that I looked forward to. Next page. That's Tanner. He used to be my best friend. My only friend. Who's that you were talking to? Oh, Liv? Yeah, so are you going to... Going to what? Ask her out, dumbass. You obviously like her, so just ask her out. I bet she likes you too. Well, I actually did take his advice. And from there, things were pretty great. Well, it's all gone now. All fucking gone. And it wasn't my fault. It was his. Hey, Cal. You finished that history homework? I hate that nickname. Sounds like my name's short for California or something. So how are you and Liv doing? <laughs> We're fine. What do you care? Hang on. I'll talk to you later. I'm pretty sure he only hung out with me to copy off my homework. It's whatever. I got something out of it too. How do you know Tanner? He's in my gov class. Um, I need to talk to you. Talk, talk about what? Um, never mind, I'll talk to you later. I had to stay after school that day to retake a test. It was a Friday.
Hey, Liz. Liz. What's going on? Calvin. What? Can we talk for a sec? What do we need to talk about? This is awkward. Calvin. What? I, I can't do this anymore. We're done. Calvin, you seriously can't, like, this can't be a surprise to you. You're so, like, arrogant. I can't, like, ever get a hold of you. You're always, like, you never listen. I, like, I try my best to talk to you. She talked and talked. Something about me being self-absorbed. I don't know, I wasn't listening. It's all bullshit anyway. I got it in the Boy Scouts. There was a sheath at some point, but I lost it. I was stung by a stingray once. Hurt like hell. The funny thing is, I didn't even see it. I was at the beach with my parents. It was one of those rare moments where we were all together. Back when they actually liked each other. I ran into the ocean because I used to love the feel of the cold water on my feet. And then, my foot burned. I ran back to the shore, screaming. And I never even saw the stingray. What Tanner? You uh need any help with those? Dude, no. Sure? Yeah, dude, I'm sure. They look pretty heavy. Dude, I'm fine. Alright. See yourself. What the fuck do you want, Tanner? I don't need your pity. It's not pity, asshole. I thought we were friends. Yeah, and so did I, until you took a lift from me. Lip broke up with you? Because you're a self-centered jerk. You aren't the victim here, Cal. You're just... You're just an asshole. It was then that I knew what had to be done. My dad, he owned a warehouse for his work but he never used it. Well, I did. Can 
you like lacrosse? It's fun, right? Yeah, I guess. I don't know, I just like to watch. Yeah, I think I'd rather be in the game myself. Anyway, you Liv's friend, Katie? Yeah. Do I know you? Probably not. You're Tanner, though? Yeah, it's his um, birthday coming up soon. Uh, and I don't really know him that well. Oh. <laughs> Why are you telling me this? Well, I'm trying to figure out, like, the stuff he likes, the places he goes, you know. Oh, why don't you ask Liv? She and Tanner are really close. Yeah, I, I could. But, um, I don't want her ruining the surprise, you know? Oh, okay. Um, well, I do know that Liv likes to hang out with Tanner by the marketplace over there. Uh-huh. Yeah, no, apparently Tanner has a friend that works at an ice cream shop there, and he gives them free ice cream. <sighs> must be nice having a friend like that. Yeah, must be nice. Okay, I'll be seeing you, Katie. You got any plans for the weekend? No, why? Just thinking you and I can go see a movie. Is that a date? Then no. After Calvin, I... But I'm not Calvin. So maybe we... Hey, watch where you're sleeping. I was saying. Some people, they might call me a monster. Stingrays might seem like monsters, too, but only until you realize their situation. 
They're lonely creatures. They only strike when threatened. Just like the one that stung me. Tom, where are you? Just someplace private. Somewhere where we can be alone. I understand you're hurt, but this is- Well, this is not about me being hurt. This is about how you two conspired against me. Oh, welcome to the party, Tanner. What the fuck? Oh, don't worry. I just need you two to understand. Understand what? This is crazy, man. Understand what? What do you think? Without you two, I had... I, I don't have anyone. I, I need you to understand. What? We didn't work out as a couple, but I understand how... I understand you must have felt really hurt. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah, I, I would have liked to be friends with you too. <laughs> oh, so you could copy off my homework. What? No, I, I thought you were pretty cool. Weird, but... but cool. In your own kind of way. I'm sorry you felt like we left you. It must have felt terrible. All I wanted was my own life back. I mean, really, all I wanted was... I mean, if you guys had been like this a week ago, I... I wouldn't have had to kidnap you. Uh, no. You wouldn't have had to kidnap us either way. Because normal people don't kidnap their friends. Oh, sorry. Not friends. You don't have those. Tanner! You're pathetic, Cal. You've got no one. So let us the fuck out of here. <laughs> Oh, it's all your fault. It is not my fault. Stop blaming me, asshole. I'm sorry, Calvin, but I'm not going to keep lying to you. If you want someone to blame, blame yourself. Calvin? 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 Oh, I used to have the perfect life.